A long time ago? I started writing when I was twelve. Wow. But uh, for thirty years, more than thirty years probably, thirty, thirty-one years, I never sat on a bike, nor did I even think about it. My work got me busy. When I was doing a rally for the, you know, to save rivers in India, it's called Rally for Rivers. Mm -hmm. So from southern tip of India to Himalayas, I was driving. So when I came to Bangalore, there people had heard about my riding. Because at that time I was one of those who rode probably the maximum. Like in a year I would do like sixty thousand, sixty-five thousand kilometers. Yeah, wow. With those days it was a two fifty cc two stroke engine. Two stroke. Uh, yeah, and roads were hardly there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the two strokes are sick though. Those are sick. I crisscrossed India on that. So when I came to Bangalore, mm. all these kids brought one motorcycle and said, Sadhguru, you must ride. Thirty years I had not sat on a motorcycle, I was wondering, can I really ride once again now? Yeah. I chose to ride a little late in the night so that the traffic is low in the city. Mm -hmm. Then I found that I haven't lost a day. So since then I'm doing all my intercity travels on the motorcycle. So we, here we are, still the wheels are rolling, so it's okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, what about skateboarding? Have you, you know, you <laughs> somebody gifted no? me one a couple of years ago. Yeah. <clears throat> I haven't pulled it out yet. I think uh, I'm a bit too young for that. A few more years <laughs> and then maybe I'll. A few more years you're getting there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it's sick though. It's so, it's so nice to meet and like conversate with you because a lot of the videos that I've, that I've seen of you, I've, I've seen you talk about, um, you know, people like making the most out of their lives and not being so stuck in their everyday life where they're doing the same thing and working the same job every single day and just like not fulfilling their life. And I feel like that's something I've always been really thankful for as being a skateboarder is because we we have a lot of free time outside of skateboarding and then also our job is to do what we love. And then it's also like a new experience every day. Like I was saying with the street skateboarding, I just came from Toronto before this and we were skating around the city for three days straight, me and Dama right here. And it's just always, it's always new. There's new progression. There's new ways to excite yourself all the time. So if, it never uh, gets boring. 